recently announced MedLab, a new suite of artificial intelligence language models designed specifically for the healthcare industry. MedLab marks Google's latest move to gain a foothold in the lucrative healthcare AI market, where it also faces stiff competition from major rivals like Amazon and Microsoft. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Think Consulting. Today, we're diving deep into Google's announcement for healthcare AI, a topic that's been making waves in business circles around the globe. Now, before we get into the nitty gritty, please don't forget to smash that like button, hit subscribe and ring that notification bell so you never miss out on our thought-provoking content. We work very hard to bring you content, so we would appreciate if you can like and subscribe. We're also going to break down this news and explore any and all angles that come with it. For those who don't know, the MET LM suit includes two main AI models, a large model and a medium model. Both are trained on medical data to help healthcare organizations and professionals carry out complex studies, summarize doctor-patient conversations, and a whole lot more. Google also said that it will add healthcare versions of its new general AI model Gemini to MET LM in the future. Now, as a part of its announcement, Google announced that the two models in the MET LM suit large one and the medium one like that I just mentioned. Both are built on MedPalm 2, a large language model trained on medical data. The larger model is optimized for complex medical tasks that require a lot of knowledge and compute power. For example, it, it could be used to conduct studies across an entire patient population using a healthcare organization's data. The medium sized model is more lightweight, versatile, and agile. It's better suited for specific real-time functions like summarizing a doctor-patient conversation, etc. The medium model will also cost less to run than the larger model, while the larger model taps into more medical knowledge to handle complicated analysis. The medium model is agile and nimbler for targeted use cases, needing a faster processing time. While Google was an early mover in leveraging AI for healthcare, starting with their deep mind going back to 2016, Amazon has been aggressively expanding its healthcare capabilities, most notably with the acquisition of primary care company One Medical for about 3.9 billion earlier this year. Microsoft also poses a formidable threat with its massive cloud infrastructure and development of healthcare AI services like cloud for healthcare. Although Google has a strong position with its AI, advanced research and cloud platform, winning market share will depend on convincing healthcare providers that MedLM delivers superior capabilities over the competitive offerings. Some experts point to MedLM's customizable suit of models tuned on medical data as an advantage over more general purpose AI from other vendors. But the ability to integrate services into clinical workflows and provide robust data privacy protections will be key differentiators as healthcare organizations evaluate their AI options. While the healthcare AI space has room for multiple players, overcoming established relationships and healthcare expertise at Microsoft and Amazon remains a formidable and uphill battle for the Google Cloud. In addition to that, Google also plans to introduce healthcare-specific versions of Gemini to MedLM in the future. According to Google, Gemini is the company's newest and most capable AI model. While Gemini was met with great hype and fanfare upon its launch in early December of 2023, Google says that the model is still in early stages when it comes to healthcare applications. According to Greg Corrado, the head of Google's Health AI, Gemini needs to go through the same testing and validation process as the MedPalm 2 before it can be trusted for real-world medical use cases. The real-world use cases at HCA Healthcare, one of the largest health systems in the US, MedLM is being used to help emergency medicine physicians automatically document their interactions with patients. For instance, HCA is using an ambient speech documentation system to transcribe doctor-patient meetings. MedLM can then take these transcripts and break them into components of an ER provider note. Dr. Michael Schlosser, a senior vice president of care transformation at HCA, 
said that they have been using med alum within emergency rooms at four of their hospitals and want to expand its use over the next year. By January 24, Schlosser expects Google's technology will be able to generate over half of a provider note without any input from the physician. For physicians who spend up to four hours a day on paperwork, this one move could take significant effort and time on the physician side. Schlosser also said that HCA is working to use MedLM to develop a handoff tool for nurses between shifts. Handoffs are laborious and a major pain point for nurses, so automating this with MedLM could be a very impactful move. Nurses do about 400,000 handoffs per week at HCA, and two HCA hospitals have been testing the AI-powered nurse handoff tool. Despite the potential of what the technology holds, MedLM and other healthcare AI models come with important challenges and cautions that must be considered before full implementation happens. One of the biggest issues highlighted by early testers is the risk of incorrect or fabricated AI outputs. The models are not foolproof and cannot be fully trusted to provide accurate information in every case. HCA Healthcare, for example, has found incorrect outputs to be a significant problem in their testing. They are also working with Google to establish best practices to minimize these AI fabrications before they expand use to more broad systems across their healthcare system. This aligns with experts emphasizing that the hype and promises around these AI models sometimes outstrips the reality. The technology shows a lot of promise, but is still very nascent, especially for direct clinical applications. While capabilities will continue improving, for now, healthcare organizations need a human-in-the-loop model and safeguard against any AI errors or fabrications that negatively impact patients. Responsible implementation requires extensive testing, validation, and risk analysis to protect patient health and safety. MedLM shows a lot of promise for automating the laborious process of nurse handoffs between shifts. Nurse handoffs where critical patient information is relayed to the next nurse coming on the shift happens over 400,000 times per week across HCA healthcare hospitals. This frequent and repetitive task is a major pain point and productivity drain for the nursing teams. HCA healthcare has been testing MedLM specifically for streamlining these handoffs between nurses across some of its hospitals. The AI is designed to review patient charts and electronic health records, then identify the most relevant details to include in the handoff report. This automated report is compared side by side to a traditionally developed manual report. Initial feedback from the nurses indicates the AI-generated handoffs are comprehensive, accurate, and also efficient. By automating this rote documentation task, nurses could gain back valuable time to focus on direct patient care. HCA aims to roll out the MedLM nurse handoff tool more widely over the next year. If successful, it could significantly reduce the burden of paperwork and allow nurses to dedicate their skills where they are needed the most. This use case shows the potential of AI to target frustrating productivity bottlenecks in healthcare. HCA Healthcare has been testing another technology from Google to help emergency medicine physicians automatically document their interactions with their patients. Like I mentioned earlier, Schlosser expects Google's technology will be able to successfully generate more than half of a note without any input from providers. Doctors who spend up to four hours a day on cl clerical paperwork will appreciate the time that this technology is gonna uh, help them make a meaningful difference in their lives. Google's new AI models are also being utilized by other companies in the healthcare space. One such company is Bench Sky, which aims to use AI to solve problems in drug discovery. Google is also an investor in Bench Sky, and the company has been testing MedLM technology for a few months now. Bench Sky has merged MedLM's AI capabilities with their own technology to help scientists identify biomarkers, which are keys to understanding disease progression and their potential cures. After extensive testing and providing feedback to Google for improvements, Bensky is now bringing this AI integration to the market more broadly. Another Google Cloud customer exploring uses for MedLM is Deloitte. Deloitte has tested MedLM extensively 
before deploying it with its healthcare clients. One application is using Google's AI to help health systems and insurance plans answer patient questions about accessing healthcare. For example, patients can query MedLM to find providers for a colonoscopy based on gender, location, accepted insurance, and any other preferences. While it's not a substitute for diagnosis from a professional, Deloitte's clients find that MedLM provides accurate and efficient assistance in improving access to care. In summary, Google's new MedLM suite of healthcare AI models provides promising capabilities, but still faces challenges. The models aim to assist clinicians and researchers with complex studies, patient interaction summaries, and other workflows that are critical. However, the technology that's there today requires careful implementation, risk analysis to avoid major risks. MedLM marks Google's continued push into healthcare AI amid competition from other major players like Amazon and Microsoft. Early adopters like HCA Healthcare, Benchside, and Deloitte are optimistically deploying MedLM for select use cases after extensive testing. The AI shows particular promise for automating nursing handoffs and documentation at these facilities. Thank you for joining us today on Think Consulting. I'm Vikar, and I hope you found this in-depth analysis helpful and enlightening. Overall, in my mind, MedLM exemplifies the potential of AI in healthcare, but also the need for responsible development and testing. As companies fine-tune these models, it could significantly improve clinical workflows. However, hospitals are rightly proceeding with caution. Google and its partners will need to focus on accuracy, safety, and human AI collaboration as this technology evolves. Please let me know in the comment section below about your thoughts of this new groundbreaking technology. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe for more discussions on consulting, on healthcare, and what impacts you in general. Until our next video, stay well informed, and I will see you in the next video. Stay well.